what it is, baby. But yeah, Deontay Wilder says that Anthony Joshua needs to take Jermaine Franklin very, very seriously, right? And I think that's, you know, kind of a obvious statement because Anthony Joshua knows what happens when you don't take a fighter seriously as whenever he lost to Andy Ruiz. So I think that situation humbled him and lets him know like, yeah, man, I can fall to somebody. You know what I'm saying? I don't care what the skill set is. It's heavyweight division. It's boxing. Anything can happen. So I think Joshua is in a whole different mode right now, especially after taking the L's to Usyk back to back. Right. So it's like, I right, it's time for me to kick it into another gear. And um, I think, like I said, he going to probably dominate this fight. You know what I'm saying? It's probably going to be boring as hell. But I think he's just trying to, you know, find the rhythm again. This is like a throwaway fight like Andy Ruiz was supposed to be. But he underestimated him and then ended up getting beat. I don't think he'll ever do that again. And I think with him thinking he, he might retire or even kind of teasing the idea, I think he's going to put – is all into boxing right now before he ends up hanging the gloves up. So I think, yeah, it's, he he's not going to take Jermaine Franklin lightly, right? And hopefully when this fight does happen, man, he can start fighting the people that people want him to see, you know, that people want to see him fight, whether it be Deontay Wilder or Tyson Fury next. Well, they fight tonight. It's Saturday. It's April 1st right now. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to probably make a video about who wins and all that. So good luck, Anthony Joshua. Good luck, good luck, Jermaine Franklin. And um, that's all I got for right now, man. Can y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share the video, man? I really appreciate it. Well, that's all I got for right now, man. Y'all be easy and y'all stay safe.